Good morning, welcome back to another vlog. So if you saw some of my most recent vlogs, you know that I was away for almost a month and I've just been basically playing catch up and my parents are actually coming down here this Saturday which today's Thursday, so in two days, my parents are coming down and they're staying with me for a week. So I have been working super hard this week to not only get caught up, but also try to like work ahead so that I can have some content like pre-recorded so that I don't have to worry about filming while they're here. And I also am, you know, trying to get my apartment clean and ready for them to come. And I just have like, you know, some things on my to-do list, basically. So I thought that I would start a new vlog and kind of bring you along. I still have all of my bags and my suitcase from my trip. I unpacked right away, but I have yet to put the bags back in my closet because it's just kind of chaotic in here and I've been dreading it. So that's what we're gonna work on this morning. I just really need to declutter. I have quite a bit of clothes in here that I just don't wear anymore and it's just taking up space so we're gonna downsize a bit and this video is sponsored by Poshmark so I am going to be listing all of the items that I decide I don't want to keep on the Poshmark app if you're unfamiliar with Poshmark, they are the leading marketplace for selling and buying fashion. You can shop over 9,000 brands in every size and score up to 70% off retail prices. And you can list all of your items totally for free, so it's a great way to just make some extra cash from home. I've used Poshmark in the past and it's really easy to use. So I'm just gonna sort through the clothes that I have and I'm just gonna pull out anything that I don't really wear anymore, that I don't want to keep and I'm gonna do the same thing with my sunglasses because my sunglass case is overflowing and then we will sort through everything that I have and take photos get it all listed on the app Okay, I have all of my items. Honestly, there's more stuff in there that I feel like I probably could slash should sell, but I don't know. I need to I need to wait and see. You know when there's certain items that you're like, I know I don't ever really wear this anymore, but I still kind of love it and I'm not really ready to part with it just yet because like there's still that slight chance that maybe I'll want to wear it one day you know it's like that but these are the items that I, I feel good about listing so the first thing that we have is this dress from American Eagle I guess on a taller person it probably would be more like a midi length I am 5'2 and this is where it falls on me so if you're taller it probably yeah it's it's more of a midi dress I guess I love the back this is one of those items that I think I only wore this maybe two times and then I got my boobs done and uh, it doesn't fit me anymore kind of sad to let it go because it's so pretty but there's no point in me keeping it if it doesn't fit this is the next thing that I'm gonna be listing it's I don't even know what you would consider it but it's just this open flowy top that you can tie up like this which is so cute kind of sad to let this go as well but it's I, I just never wear it so um, and this is from misguided the next thing I'm gonna be listing are these little tiny booty shorts from American Eagle these are super stretch so they're really comfy and they're in a size six then I have these paper bag jeans from Zara these are in a size eight Next, I am going to be listing this top from Abercrombie. This too, I've only worn a handful of times. It's just not really my style anymore. I think I just bought it because it's such a pretty top, but it's just not really me. So 
I'll be listing that. This is in a size large. Next thing I'll be listing is this dress from Cup She. It just buttons all the way down and it has pockets, the best part. This is in a size medium. The next thing I have is a dress from Urban Outfitters. This is a maxi dress with a V cut. Super cute. I love this dress so much. It just again post boob job it just doesn't fit this is in a size medium and then the last clothing item i'm going to be listing is another abercrombie top super super cute and the sleeves are like a little bit puffy and then it ties in the back so the back is a little bit open really really cute Again, I've only worn it a few times. This is in a size large. Just not really my style so much anymore these days. Okay, I got all of the listings up on my closet so if you want to purchase any of these items or sell items of your own download the poshmark app my username on there is sam underscore they same as my instagram handle um, but i'll have a link to my closet in the description so yeah go ahead and check it out thank you so much poshmark for sponsoring this portion of the video i'm gonna put some makeup on and do my hair and get filming i'm planning on filming a hair care routine video which i got a few clips i washed my hair last night i got some clips of me washing my hair and blowing it out and all that so i need to actually film like the talking portion of it and then i have a hair color video that i want to record when i was up visiting my family a couple weeks ago i went into sally's with my mom and i recorded some clips in there and i was just taking a look at what products they have in there because I haven't been to a Sally's in a long time you know like ever since I got licensed as a cosmetologist I've just been going to like professional only places so I wanted to take a look and get some recommendations so I'm going to do a video sharing like how to properly color your hair at home using stuff from Sally's and then I have a sponsored thing for Instagram that I need to record as well by the way I got the new makeup forever HD skin that everyone's been raving about and I do really like it but if you're looking for a dupe the essence pretty natural foundation is six dollars from Ulta and it has a very similar finish but I like this one even a little bit better because it's completely transfer proof Whereas this one, I feel like throughout the day, it, yeah, like it, it, it lasts a long time and it really holds up. But as I start to get oily throughout the day, especially in this summer humidity, um, it definitely will transfer. But I do really love the color of the Makeup Forever one. I feel like I have a pretty neutral skin tone and it's tricky for me to get a foundation that's like the perfect color match because they're usually way too yellow or like too pink but this is in the shade 2n34 and it's like a perfect match i feel so yeah i'm gonna get all of that filming done and then later this evening i have plans with my friends we're gonna go get dinner and then after dinner we are going to i think it's called port house in downtown Wilmington on Thursday nights they do a sex toy bingo which I've heard good things I've seen it on Instagram it looks like a lot of fun that's why I especially want to just like get all my work done so then that way I can just go enjoy myself tonight with my friends so yeah I'm gonna finish getting ready and then I'll catch up with you a little bit later Okay, it's a few hours later. I just got done recording a whole bunch of content. This is the aftermath. Uh, yeah, it's a total mess. <laughs> but I'm starving now and very tired. My throat is so dry. 
from talking so much. So I am gonna make myself a smoothie. Uh, it's 3.30 now, so I need to text my friend and see what time we're gonna be doing dinner. And I probably will import all of that footage. It's a few hours later, I am about to head out to dinner with my friends. I just wanted to show you my outfit. My room is still a mess. We'll just kind of <laughs> push that under there for now. I will get everything straightened up later, but I just have this little strappy square neck bodysuit from Zara and these Abercrombie jeans. These are the Curve Love Dad jeans. And then these shoes are from Dulce Vita. I just got them recently at TJ Maxx. And this bag is from Target. And I'm obsessed with this lip combo that I have been wearing today. Charlotte Tilbury Pillow Talk Lip Liner, and then this Maybelline Lifter Gloss in the shade Amber. Okay, scratch that. Stepped outside for one second and it is so humid. Even though the temperature is not very high, but the humidity is making it feel a lot warmer, which I'm not complaining about. So, swapped out the jeans for jean shorts. These are from H&M. Everything else is still the same. Hello. It's the next day and it's already 7 p.m. <laughs> Last night was so much fun, but uh, it ended up being one of those nights where I didn't get home till like almost 4 a.m. But one of my friends down here is actually moving. This is her last weekend here. So we had to celebrate and have one last like fun night out. So I'm really glad that we did that. So yeah, needless to say today hasn't been the most productive. I slept in pretty late and then just kind of sat around, watched Netflix and then took another nap. And now I'm up. We're gonna do some cleaning. I still wanna be somewhat productive and not let this entire day just go to waste. So this is how the kitchen is looking right now. I have a few dishes in the sink that need to go in the dishwasher and I just need to kind of, you know, wipe down the counters, the stove, clean the floors, etc. And then the living room kind of needs a little cleaning up as well. And my bedroom definitely could use some tidying up as well. There's a new episode of the Mile Higher podcast on YouTube. So I'm gonna play that on the TV while I clean. Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to Mile Higher Podcast. The kitchen is all nice and clean. Look at you. Handsome. Currently washing the runner rug in here. Also straightened up the living room, vacuumed the floors. Now I just made myself some dinner and it's kind of random because I am kind of running low on groceries. I'm gonna go to the store tomorrow before my parents get here and just kind of restock and get some things you know, that I know that they like. But I just sauteed some chickpeas, mixed it in with some brown rice, and then I roasted some baby carrots and Brussels sprouts in the air fryer. Delicious.
hello good afternoon it is now saturday i have just been running around all day like a chicken with my head cut off so i completely just wasn't in vlog mode as you saw this morning i did straighten up my room so my apartment is now officially clean then i went out and got my nails done and then i went grocery shopping and i am currently making dinner for my parents because they should be here any minute oh actually here they are they're walking up right now i'm excited to spend the week with them and the, it was perfect timing i literally got everything done that i needed to literally in the nick of time so i'm gonna wrap up this video here thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to check the link in my description to download the poshmark app and go follow me there and check out my listings but i will see you guys in my next video bye